What's up guys, this is Burt Music and welcome to the secret AK-74U in Modern Warfare. The AK-74U variant is something that I just unlocked. I got my AK-47 to level 56, which is a lot of weapon level grinding and I'm pretty sure you have to get it to at least 56 to get all the attachments that you're gonna need. As far as I know, currently you can't unlock an AK-74U variant, so you just have to level up the AK-47. And once you have your AK-47 to level 56, you might wanna just actually save a custom mod of it, which is exactly what I did. If we go to the armory, here's exactly what you need. You only need three attachments to make the AK-74U in this game. You need the 8.1 inch compact barrel attachment. And honestly, I think you can use either the skeleton stock or no stock but i think the skeleton stock is kind of like more traditional for the ak-74u i'm probably gonna try out both in this video and the last attachment you need is the ammunition attachment which gives it a 30 round mag which is going to reduce your damage in your range but increase the fire rate so yeah that's pretty much all you need to make the ak-74u in modern warfare i am gonna add some extra attachments to make this thing even better though but it's pretty much good to go i haven't used this thing at all so i kind of want to test it out in a private match first all right let's see how good or terrible this thing is gonna be this is pretty much just like playing hardcore against bots oh. okay it handles pretty interestingly Definitely has some pretty serious recoil. It's probably because of the fire rate increase. And I don't think any of the attachments are going to help with recoil control. It's definitely pretty snappy though. It handles like an SMG. I'm definitely going to have to use this thing online though to get a real feel for it. Is it a one shot though? It's a one shot up close, but oh, okay. This thing's probably going to get some hit markers in hardcore. Honestly, I don't think this thing's going to do very well online, but it should be fun to use. Hopefully it's not as bad as the M16 variant that I used last time. Now it's time to find an online match. Ooh, got some hardcore dumb on shoot house. This should be pretty good for an ak 74 u Someone's name is Garbage with an I am Clan Tech. Hopefully this is a good lobby. I might actually be able to hit something. Honestly, doing this video has me a little bit worried because I have not used the AK-74U variant yet. I just got this thing to level 56 and I have not had a chance to actually try it out. Oh, okay, that is not very good. There are another people. Oh, this one behind me. I'm going the wrong way. Ah! He ignored me too. There he is. There's more over here. Oh, come on. Oh, come on, garbage is camping. At least we know why that's your name now. Contested. Oh, there's a guy there? Come on, let's get a feed. Go, 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 go. That was a double kill. Wait, what? Did I get a quad? <laughs> See you there. Wow, my aim is good. I hear you. Don't you fucking dare. No! <laughs> Fighting for B so hard. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Triple? Nope. nope. Garbage is head glitching back there. This dude really is garbage. I mean, look at our, our campers, too. In the corner. Camp Everyone's fucking camping! Smallest map in the game, still camping. Does not matter. Oh, my. See you back there, garbage. Don't you fucking dare. <laughs> Filthy camper. Oh my god, he's getting 725. They're all get all the campers are getting shotgun right now. Oh, there you go. Come on. Another guy calling the kill streak. Let's keep this feed going. Keep it going. Ah, it's gone. <laughs> I feel like it's actually really difficult to tell if the AK 74U is any good. This is just a really shit lobby. Oh. Oh, come on. I was running out of ammo. I had like no ammo left there. I think that'll be the weakest point about this AK-74U variant is the 30 round magazine. You just run out of ammo way too quickly. Plus you lose a lot of damage in range by equipping it. This is not that good. Maybe I'll try swapping it out. See if that'll help at all. 75 round AK-74U. No stock also. Let's see how it does now. In the corner. Laying down. Head glitching. I can't. Ah, too much recoil. This thing's recoil is what ends up killing it. It's not like the M4, which is a laser beam. Oh. Pop that head on. There we go. Nice and easy. Garbage camper. My instinct with a gun like this is to spray and pray for sure, but you can still be kind of accurate with it. Whoa, another camper. Oh, 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 oh my God. They're still spawning here. What? A teammate killed me. Dude, I was popping off. I had a mega. What was that? Six or seven man? I think mega kill seven man. That was really good. I think I got a VTOL. <laughs> okay. Yeah. The 75 rounds definitely helped. Hi, how are you? Oh, come on. Leaning there. You really are garbage, dude. Oh god, he's done. I, am I shooting him? Kill it? Make him. Oh, okay. <laughs> that was horrible. <laughs> I will say I like the AK 74U variant when it's less of an AK 74U. When it has 75 rounds, it's not too bad. When it only has 30, it's kind of horrible. I am going to switch it back when I go to play core, though. Ah, uh, he's just head glitching up there. Of course you are, garbage. Mounting up in a second story. Thank God that lobby is over. I ended up dropping over 50 kills and I managed to hit this clip right here, but man, it was a struggle. That lobby could have definitely gone better. Especially if the dude named Garbage wasn't in it. I'm changing it back to the 30 rounds and putting the skeleton stock on. Now let's go try it out in core. Domination on Piccadilly. For once, I think I'm actually gonna try to play Piccadilly because this thing's gonna be bad no matter what in core. I just have a feeling. My initial impressions of using the AK-74U in hardcore is that it's definitely better than the M16 variant of the M4. The whole OG variant. That thing was terrible. This is definitely a little bit better and I I think it's just because it's a full auto gun. But since this AK-74U variant is not that good in hardcore, it's probably not gonna be good in core either. I'm worried about this. All right, guys, soldiers, we're entering the shittiest map of Modern Warfare. 
Get out. Go get some hit markers. I'm so screwed. I'm legitimately worried about using this thing. I'm, I'm going right to C to catch them off guard. It's the only way to kill someone with this. Oh, he's already going to camp up there. This dude. Okay. Okay. Stop this. Stop this. Oh, shit. Ah, he's double C4ing. Really? Who sits on the stairs and waits with the C4? That is so pathetic. Might actually be worse than using claymores. Because the people who use claymores are lazy. They just put it down and they go camp, whatever. But you have to actively be paying attention to use C4. That makes that guy the worst kind of camper. Enemy movement. Enemy movement. God, why the fuck? Everyone's just crouching around. Now I know why I never play this map. Fuck off. Weirdly enough, I don't think it's that bad in core. You do lose some of your damage, you lose some of your range, but the fire rate kind of helps out. And I'm playing on a map that's mostly dominated by assault rifles and the snipers. Oh, there's more. There were more. Come on, let's... Oh! Let me get it. Oh, let's go feed. Let's keep it going. More. Oh my god! You know, this thing's not bad. It's running out of ammo so fast, though. I knew there was another guy that got the VTOL. Not bad! <laughs> Camping. Got something special for you. Oh! <laughs> Dead kill streak. Come back in. Why not? This thing is actually pretty good, guys. I am pleasantly surprised with this right now. And bullets. Let's make it count. Oh, he's trying to stun me. Come on. Oh! Fast! I'm actually really surprised I got a quad feed in hardcore and core. I think I've kind of changed my mind. This thing's actually pretty good. One thing I've definitely noticed is that you are more mobile while using the AK-47. When you put all these attachments on, you definitely move a little bit faster. It's pretty good for a running gun play style. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> Just laying down. Oh, there's another guy right here camping. There we go. Not bad, not bad. Another dude camping. Everyone's camping. Gotta love to see that. They're not gonna expect me. <laughs> I got another VTOL. Oh, it's definitely suffering at range, that's for sure. I definitely feel like the feeds that I've hit with this AK-74U have been kind of lucky. I feel like I've definitely caught some people off guard because it's really not that good. Like, there are definitely much better guns to use instead of this, but it is fun to try out, which is really the whole point of why I do these videos. It's just to kind of branch out and try some new things, because you never know if it's going to be good if you haven't tried it yet. Oh, hello. Holy shit, we actually traded? Man, if you're that bad with an M4, though, oh my god. <laughs> There's no helping that person. Nope. Okay, someone just got a scuff. Fresh off of Infinite Warfare, I see. Dude, this person has got to chill. Their X button is going to have PTSD. Post-traumatic spam disorder. For fuck's sake. This dude is a goddamn crackhead. He's got my gun. Put it away. This doesn't belong to you. Stop jumping. <gasps> Damn, I almost dropped 50 kills in this game too. That's not bad for Piccadilly, considering how horrible this map is. And of course this had to be played because I was just tearing it up. Oh my god. What was that, like five or six man play of the game? Jesus. That was worth a 30 round mag and core, that's not bad. But the real test for the AK-74U is to see how it performs in realism TDM. Let's do this. Oh my god, guys, this gun is fucking trash. I can't even camp with it. Worst shotgun in modern warfare. I'm deleting this game, I'm done. But that's gonna do it for this video. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me use the AK-74U in Modern Warfare. If you guys have any suggestions for other weird variants that I should check out and try on Modern Warfare, make sure to leave a comment letting me know. And again, I really do hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did it and you wanna see some more weird guns on Modern Warfare, make sure to drop a like. I'll see you guys later.